I'm here at the Yoga Collective with celebrity trainer Andrea Orbeck to learn a 10-minute arm circuit. So grab your five and three pound dumbbells and join us in today's Class Fit Sugar. Okay, so standing nice and tall in your frame, make sure to roll your shoulder blades back the whole time. With your elbows at your ribs, palms facing up, we're gonna do 25 posture curls. Go ahead and lift up and slowly lower. Make sure that you're tall in your frame and your shoulders are down and back. You don't want the 10 pounds in your hands to make you slouch. Nice work. Pull up and slowly lower. Very good. So while you're doing these, we want to isolate the biceps, making sure that you're not losing your shoulder blades in this movement. Good job. We're going to keep going for 10, nine more, eight, good, seven. Keep your booty nice and quiet, abs are on, shoulders down and back. We're going to hold after four, last three, and two. Now keep your palms at the top. Making sure your shoulders are down and back, elbows into ribs, decelerate to halfway, 45 degrees, and roll on back up. So you're gonna eccentrically lower, contract them up. We're here for 10, this is eight more, seven. Booty strong, six more, last five, four more, three, two, one more curl up, decelerate to 45, hold it there, feel the biceps doing the work, Straighten your arms and then curl back up to 45. So we want to make sure we're getting every inch of the bicep contraction in this movement. Shoulders down and back, add that posture. Five more, four, you're going to start to feel that burn. Last three, last two, good. Now hold, lift your chest, let those biceps hold the weight. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, straighten your arms. While they're still burning, go ahead and trade these fives up for your threes. Now that the biceps are all awake, go back into that nice tall posture and we're gonna run the bicep curls. Palms facing up, you're gonna curl up, alternating. We're gonna go all the way to 30, nice and quick. Try not to move your frame, keep the biceps isolated. Try and stay strong in your frame. Don't wiggle. Let those biceps run up nice and fast. They're gonna burn out quick, even with using just threes. Here we go, 10, nine more. Shoulder, shoulders, long neck. There's four and three, two, good, and one. Go back to that 45 degrees, squeeze your tush together, and go ahead and do rotator cuff. So while your biceps are holding in a static hold, get some posture in there as well. Good. Last three till they stay open and two. Now keep them open in here and we're gonna do last 20 lowering and lifting all the way up. All that energy you have left in those bicep curls. Here we go. Good. Pull those shoulder blades together, keep it going. Mine are starting to burn. Here we go, 10 more, 10, nine, eight more, seven burning arms. Three, here we go, two, very good. One, and slowly lower, good. So we're gonna go ahead and do triceps. You're gonna trade those threes back for the fives. And keeping your arms in a 90 degree angle, you're gonna go ahead and turn, tilting over slightly through your tailbone and your knees, pull your elbows back, and you're gonna extend your arms straight and slowly lower. Now the key with this is to keep a nice long spine, weight is in the heels, back is slightly arched, elbows straighten and bend. Here we go, good. Now the key is to keep that posture while you're straightening and bending the elbows Keep going, 15, 14. Nice long frame, good. 12 more, 11, 10, and nine. Watch your posture, eight. Chin tucked in, nice long neck. Straighten those elbows, you're gonna feel your triceps burning. 
four more. We're gonna do static in three, good, in two. Now hold those triceps, elbows stay straight. Now pulse 10 times up with straight arms. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Through your knees, go ahead and stand on up. Trade these fives again for the threes and go back into position. Bent over, tricep extension. This time we're gonna do single arms and run them fast for power. Hinge over at your waist, pull elbows back. One arm at a time, one, two, three. All the way to 30. Those burnt out triceps are gonna get their last bit of opportunity for tone and strength. Keep going. 20, 19, 18, good. Long neck, breathing, I know they're burning. Here's 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, hold on, 4, 3 with posture, 2, and 1. Good job. Go ahead and stand up. So you're going to take your fives and go ahead and lay flat on your back for the rest of the triceps on the mat. So we're going to go ahead and finish the tricep circuit on the mat. Laying flat on your back, take your fives. With your feet flat, knees bent, extend your arms like you're sleepwalking. Draw your shoulders clearly away from your ears. Bend your elbows so that the weight is close. Now from here, you're gonna straighten and bend. Straighten and bend. You want a strong, fast, aggressive tempo. Bend down and straighten. We're here for 30. Those fives are gonna really burn out the triceps, so make sure that you keep your shoulders clearly away from your ears. Very good. Abs are nice and tight. And as you start to burn out and you feel like those triceps are burning, you can slow down your tempo, just keep your form. Good. Here we go, 10. Nine more. Well done, keep going. I know it's starting to burn. Think of how great those arms are gonna look when you wave at someone and the arms don't wave back. Here we go. After two, keep your arms nice and straight. Again, pull your shoulders down. You're gonna lower your elbows to your ribs, bending the elbows down into a 90 degree, and then press up. Find your triceps in the movement. Again, it's a hearty tempo, up and down, up and down. Good, great time to make sure your shoulders are away from your ears and your abs are on. Use your core stability to keep you nice and quiet through this movement. Good, isolate those tries. Well done, make sure you're breathing. You're gonna start to feel those arms getting heavy. Be cross with your tempo, here we go, good. Last 10, last nine, eight. Hold on for five more, four more, last three, Last two, very good, last one. Bend your elbows to the ground, straighten your arms so your fives are back on the mat. Switch them out for the threes, and then go ahead and straighten your arms again. Like you're sleepwalking, draw your shoulders down and back. We're gonna do the tricep press, except you're gonna do single arms relatively fast. You're gonna bend one arm, palm by the temple and lift, palm by the temple and lift. Here we go. Now make sure you're not shrugging in this movement. You don't want your traps to do the work. You're isolating your tricep. One and down, two and down. One and down, two and down. Good. Turn on your lats. Make sure that your back is involved with holding the posture. Very good. Abs are strong and tight. Nice and quick. 20 more. Keep the shoulders down. There's a tendency to shrug when you do French press. You need to be aware of where your posture's at. Very good, 12 more. Seven, six, last four, last three, last two, last one, double arms. Last time, 20, both arms are gonna go down by the temples and then straighten up nice and quick, power out these last 20. Very good, keep going. Know where your posture is. Now squeeze your abs in for the last 10. 
seven. Here's five more. Here's four more. Three and two and one. Elbows down by your sides, palms down. Lift your hands above your head and stretch them out. Very good. Good arm circuit. Thanks so much for doing this with us. My pleasure. It was a great way to get out of that boring biceps tricep routine. We killed it. Definitely. See you next time on Fit Sugar TV.